ever dreamt of packing your bags and working remotely from a European paradise without breaking the bank? Well, you're in the right place. In today's video, we're diving into the top 11 most affordable European countries for remote work. From the sun-soaked streets of Spain to the charming landscapes of Romania, we've got the inside scoop on where you can live comfortably without draining your savings. Let's get started. Number 11, Spain. Currency, Euro. E-cost of living in Spain is relatively low, especially when compared to the US and other Western European countries. In Madrid and Barcelona, you can expect to pay around $1,000 per month for a one-bedroom apartment. And if you're willing to live outside of the major cities, you can find some real bargains. Of course, rent prices will be even lower in smaller towns and villages. Spain is known for its sunny climate, but it can get pretty hot in summer. Think 40C slash 104F if you don't like the heat, Spain might not be for you. Average monthly rent in Madrid city center, $1,004. Average real estate price per square foot, $471. Three course meal for two at mid-range restaurant, $61. Number 10, Greece. Currency, Euro. The cost of living in Greece is relatively low compared to other European countries, especially when you compare it to cities like London or Paris. In Athens, the capital, you can expect to pay around $600 per month for a one-bedroom apartment. Outside of the city, prices are even lower. And when it comes to food and drink, you can get by on a budget of $30.40 per day. It's fairly easy to get residency in Greece. For example, by using the affordable Greece Golden Visa program, one of the cheapest golden visas in Europe. Average monthly rent in Athens city center, $510. Average real estate price per square foot, $231. Three course meal for two at mid-range restaurant, $51.11. Number 9. Poland. Currency, Pen. According to Nambeo, the cost of living in Warsaw is nearly 30% cheaper than in London, and around 20% cheaper than in New York City. Rent is particularly affordable, with a one-bedroom apartment in the city center costing an average of just $600 per month. The country's infrastructure is not as developed as in other parts of Europe, and internet speeds can be slow outside of major cities. Additionally, the winters can be harsh, and daylight hours are limited. Average monthly rent in Warsaw City Center, $639. Average real estate price, per square foot, $386. Three-course meal for two at mid-range restaurant, $38. Number 8. Latvia. Currency, Euro. The cost of living in Latvia is significantly lower than in other Western European countries, so you'll be able to save up quite a bit of money. Of course, there are downsides to living in Latvia as well. The weather can be quite unpredictable, and winters can be brutally cold. What's more, it gets dark very early in winter, and stays light very late during summer. This can be difficult for sleeping. Average monthly rent in Riga city center, $470, Average real estate price per square foot, $231. Three course meal for two at mid-range restaurant, $51.11. Number seven, Lithuania. Currency, Euro. Lithuania is often touted as one of the cheapest countries in Europe, and for good reason. Expenses like food, transportation, and utilities are relatively low and rental prices are reasonable. English is not as widely spoken in Lithuania as in some other European countries, which can make everyday tasks like grocery shopping or going to the bank more challenging. Overall, Lithuania can be an interesting option for remote workers on a tight budget, but it's important to be aware of the potential drawbacks. Average monthly rent in Vilnius city center, $710. Average real estate price per square foot, $354. Three course meal for two at mid-range restaurant, $51. 
Number 6. Slovakia. Currency, Euro. Slovakia is quickly becoming a popular destination for remote workers, and it's not hard to see why. The cost of living is relatively low, especially when compared to other European countries. In fact, Slovakia is often cited as one of the cheapest countries in Europe. Of course, there are some downsides to living in Slovakia as a remote worker. The winters can be long and harsh, and the internet connectivity isn't always reliable. Average monthly rent in Bratislava city center, $645. Average real estate price per square foot, $445. Three course meal for two at mid-range restaurant, $40. Number 5. Croatia. Currency, Euro. Since John 1, 2023, in terms of accommodation, utilities, and food, Croatia is significantly cheaper than many European countries. For example, you can rent a one-bedroom apartment in Zagreb, the capital, for as little as $500 per month. And while restaurants are relatively inexpensive, most Croatians prefer to cook at home using fresh produce from the local market. As well as Zagreb, you should also check out coastal towns such as Zadar, Dubrovnik, and Split. Average monthly rent in Zagreb city center, $522. Average real estate price per square foot, $334. Three course meal for two at mid-range restaurant, $40. Number four, Czech Republic. Currency, cheese, K. The cost of living in Czech Republic is quite reasonable, especially when compared to the US and many Western European countries. The average monthly rent for a one-bedroom apartment in Prague is around $800, and you can easily find a meal for two at a decent restaurant for less than $40. So, it really depends on your individual needs as to whether Prague or one of the smaller cities would be a better fit. Average monthly rent in Prague city center, $849, Average real estate price per square foot, $704. Three course meal for two at mid-range restaurant, $37. Number three, Portugal. Currency, Euro. Beautiful Portugal has become one of Europe's top destinations for emigrating Americans, especially retirees and remote workers. It's been my main base since 2020. Rent prices in much of Portugal are affordable compared to the US. Although prices in Lisbon are rising rapidly, food and transportation costs are relatively low as well, making Portugal an attractive option for remote workers on a budget. Portugal is a great place to live and work remotely. Although prices are rising with proper research, you won't have to break the bank to do it. Average monthly rent in Lisbon city center, $1,391, Average real estate price per square foot, $491. Three course meal for two at mid-range restaurant, $45. Number two, Bulgaria. Currency, Ben. If you're looking for an affordable place to live and work remotely, Bulgaria should definitely be on your radar. Sofia, the capital of Bulgaria, is one of the most affordable capitals in Europe. Rent for a one-bedroom apartment in the city center averages around $400 per month, and basic groceries are very inexpensive. When I visited Sofia in 2014, I was pleasantly surprised, first by its affordability, and second by how easy it was to get around, with many locals speaking decent English. Average monthly rent in Sofia city center $428. Average real estate price per square foot $220, Three course meal for two at mid range restaurant, $36. Number one, Romania. Currency, Ron. If you're looking for an affordable European country to base remote working operations, Romania should be at the top of your list. Despite being one of the cheapest countries in Europe, Romania offers a high quality of life, with fast internet speeds and a low cost of living. You can easily live here on a US or UK salary. According to Numbeo, the cost of living in Romania is around 50% cheaper than in the US and 30% cheaper than in the UK. 
This makes it an attractive option for anyone looking to stretch their dollar or pound further. Average monthly rent in Bucharest City Center, $459. Average real estate price per square foot, $226. Three course meal for two at mid-range restaurant, $41. There you have it, folks. The top 11 European gems where you can live the remote work dream without burning a hole in your pocket. Which country caught your eye? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this virtual journey, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more travel insights, and ring the notification bell to stay updated on our adventures. Until next time, happy travels and may your Wi-Fi be strong and your rent be low. Cheers!